acquired home state is um, gone in for 15 billion naira from the budget support bill up from the federal government. What's the position of your government on this? Uh, well, um, let me first of all thank you and say that um, I've seen similar report in the dailies. Uh, but let me put a few things in the right perspective. Number one, after the National Economic Council meeting, I am the one that addressed the press and I made that clear that it is not a bailout in the perspective that is being written about. This is called the budget support facility. And why is the federal government making this test to access this? It's simple. We are saying there is a reconciliation that is ongoing between the state government and the federal government. Some state governments are being owed a lot of money that they spent on federal roads and other federal assets. Also, there's an issue of Paris Club and so many other captions that had been raised by the state government. And what the federal government is doing, as the reconciliation is ongoing, they are providing like a live line. We all presented a budget. We are expected to show a certain level of implementation of the budget at the end of the year. And if this is June, we've not gone so much into the budget. At the end of the day, democracy is about impacting the lives of the people. And you can only do that through a normal appropriation act that you have. So what the federal government is doing is telling this, look, we have a line. You can draw on this line to implement your budget pending when we finish all the reconciliations and then what is due to or from can easily be established. So it is actually called a budget support facility. And a lot of people make a whole lot of mistake on it too. I read in one of the papers saying that it is to pay arrears of pensions. We never mentioned that at the Economic Council uh, meeting. And we never told the press that. What we told the press was clear that it is a budget support facility. Once you get it, it's to go and implement part of your budget. Nobody is telling you what to use the money for. But what we're after is, look, you presented a budget and we know there are challenges in meeting those budgets. And these challenges, I mean, uh, they were not clearly uh, foreseen when this uh, budget were, were presented, except, I mean, you were God. But if it happens that way, we must immediately react in the right direction and in a positive manner to ensure that at least we touch positively the lives of people. That's why the budget support facility was put in place between the Ministry of Finance and the Central Bank of Nigeria. And uh, let people not make that mistake again, saying, oh, states are going again for another bailout fund. Oh, states are trying to draw money now to pay areas of pensions or gratuities or salaries. Uh, it, it, that's not what we said. We said that, look, we have an ongoing reconciliation with the federal government. And pending when we complete that, let there be a lifeline where people can actually draw something, no matter how many it is. But let's be able to support the budget that we presented to our people. Because people we have all over the country, these are same federal government people. There's no special people that is called federal government people. Everybody comes from one local government area into the state and then into the federal government. That's why it was absolutely necessary for this to be put in place. So let that actually be uh, what is being captured, that is a budget support facility. What we are reading in the newspaper, that is for areas of pensions, areas of salaries, areas of gratuity, uh, that's not what we said. We said that it is to support the implementation of the budget by state. And also it's not compulsory. A state might decide to opt out of it. It's just making it available. If you want it, you can access it. If you don't want it, it's not compulsory. So as of today, you cannot actually say a state A or state B. Uh, and actually, it's one thing to apply. And another thing to actually provide all the necessary documentation 
to, 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 to draw on the funds. Even if you apply, then you don't meet all the required documentations. You won't draw on the funds. Uh, but what is important here is that the federal government have made that available. And uh, I think it's, it's, it's a positive uh, step to take at this point in time.